Hi everyone, welcome back. The 405 Winchester was introduced in 1904 as one of the cartridges for the model 1895 lever action. Here's a 308 cartridge for comparison. Even though this cartridge is closing in on 120 years, it never was a black powder round. The 405 uses a 411 diameter bullet. The original factory load was a 300 grain soft point bullet with a velocity of 2200 feet per second, producing 3200 foot pounds of muzzle energy. I use a 300 grain Barnes TSX bullet for my heavy loads. I was able to find a light load for more comfortable shooting from the Ken Waters book, Pet Loads. It consists of a 200 grain jacketed hollow point handgun bullet. It has a velocity of just over 2,000 feet per second. These loads are great for plinking and much easier on the shoulder even though the bullet is about a thou undersized. They seem to work just fine for the intended purpose. This quarter inch plate <clears throat> was hit with the 200 grain handgun bullet at about 20 yards. The expansion from the hollow point is quite impressive, leaving this 600 thou hole so if you put it in different terms, it was a 41 caliber bullet, leaving a 60 caliber hole. The 405 was Teddy Roosevelt's favorite for lion hunting, and he called it his big medicine rifle. Ammo at times is tricky uh, to find, but I've managed to secure enough uh, brass to meet my needs for some time. This is my 405 Winchester rifle. It's a little different since it's a, it's a Lee Enfield number no. four Mark I. The rifle would have been originally chambered for 303 British, but has been rebarreled to 405 and is fitted with a single shot follower. These rifles are often converted to large bore calibers such as 444 Marlin and 4570. I owned one in 444 Marlin at one time, and the cartridge being shorter made it possible to set a 410 shot shell box uh, magazine inside the existing magazine with some minor modifications. And it fed well. I think the magazine held two rounds. Many have commented about the substantial recoil of this cartridge, but I have found it to be quite manageable and even better with the light bullets, and so it's more enjoyable to shoot. Hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope you'll tune in again. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Also, I would enjoy seeing any comments you have or questions. So long for now.